excuse how I look right now. Um, I am at my aunt's house. This is actually the house I grew up in and I am now in California. Tomorrow I'm going shopping for an outfit for Saturday for, you know, Mario's class. I'm so excited guys. I'm so excited and of course I'll be filming some stuff. I know he doesn't allow you to film because obviously you don't want to put his skills out there. I mean that's what you're paying for. Probably gonna go to bed soon. I need to take a shower. Been really tired, you can tell. I've been like crying. <laughs> I was crying. It, it was just my first time leaving my kids, so it was kind of hard for me. But I got it together. All right, guys. So good night, and see you tomorrow. Hey, guys. So I am on my way to go shopping. We are going to a Santi Alley, or also known as El Callejon. <laughs> And I'm actually going to go look for an outfit for tomorrow, not tomorrow, for Saturday. Today's Thursday. So for Saturday, the master class, um, I'm not sure what I'm going to wear yet. And after we shop, I'm going to go to Porto's, I believe. I don't know, because I need me some Porto's bakery. I need them potato balls. I need them ropa vieja sandwich. Like, I love portos if you guys don't know what that is you should look it up and if you live in the la area i'm pretty sure you've been to portos if not you need to go because you're missing out so i'll catch you guys later when i'm shopping see ya early it's like 7 25 and i even had time to put on some lashes by the way these are my lashes from fancy girl beauty you can follow on instagram um so we're going to big bear right now i'm about to see snow who would have thought that i had to come to california to see snow that's why i got this like extra hat going on over here all cute so yeah i did not find an outfit yesterday unfortunately so we are gonna go today to the mall after Big Bear to see what I can find because I need an outfit for Mario's class. I need to look cute, you know what I'm saying? All right, so I'll see you guys in Big Bear. Bye. guys look at how beautiful big bear lake is right now it's completely frozen ah they just try to throw a snowball at me <laughs> hey ah! okay let's try to throw a snowball back i gotta 
get this ready. How do you make snowballs? Like this? Oh! <laughs> okay, that So, checking back in. I'm in New Mexico today. Came to Tijuana. Um, so it's a little rainy. Oop, got a little bit. Anyways, it's a little rainy today. That's why I have this little thing on and I'm cold. So, let me show you guys. I'm back so I'm on my way to the master class by Mario which is Kim Kardashian's makeup artist you guys know this and um, you know I did my makeup kind of fast because I was trying to hurry and oh I gotta fix that I gotta fix my lips but anyways so I'm super excited and um, the class starts at 12 30 registration starts at 10 30 but i'm trying to get there early because i'm trying to get a good seat i did get the platinum ones which is there they say it's the second best seat in the house and i do get to meet mario i'm gonna take a picture with him and i'll make sure to try to record a little bit i know we're not allowed to record that much so um i think it's like only 15 seconds no more than 15 seconds that i can record so i'm gonna try to get as much as little things I could get I know a lot of YouTube stars are gonna be there but I did find an outfit I had brought this dress like this striped dress um, from home I got it at Windsor and then I just purchased this like thing here that's also from Windsor and then I have these shoes going on here from Fashion Nova and my makeup of course I don't know if you can see but my lashes are from fancy girl beauty you know and yeah so i will see you guys there bye hey guys welcome back so today i'm gonna be talking about the mario master class well it's the master class by mario denovanovic so I'm going to go ahead and tell you all about it. Obviously, I won't be able to tell you, you know, all the tips and tricks because Mario asked us not to recreate everything step by step. Obviously, that's what you're paying for to go to the class. And obviously, you're paying to go to the class and learn these things, not for somebody to put it all on YouTube. Plus, it cannot sometimes the way it's explained on youtube is not the way that mario does it and then it makes mario look bad because it's like okay so this person is doing it that way and then this person is doing it this way so it's just a whole big mess so out of respect for mario i will not be giving away all of his tips from his class but i will tell you how the class went and the tea the drama Okay, the drama. And yes, this is iced tea, by the way. Thought it went well with my video. Anyways, so let me start off by saying that Mario's class was amazing. It was an amazing experience. I learned a lot of new techniques. Mario basically teaches you to think outside the box and not to follow the rules with makeup. And that's what I really took from this class. And him and Mario are the funniest together. They love to argue and bicker with each other, but obviously it's all fun and games and it's all love. Um, Kim is super sweet. She's the sweetest ever. Like, 
she'll answer all your questions she's super laid back and just herself like she's super comfortable and um she really doesn't care what anybody thinks and that's what i really like about her she's a strong woman she's a super good mom she facetimed northy while um we were there and i'll go ahead and insert the clip right now so you can watch <laughs> If you are looking to go to Mario class, um, I will let you know everything that happened at the LA class with Kim and Anastasia. It was held at the Ace Theater Hotel in downtown Los Angeles. And um, basically there was different tickets um, that you could purchase. So uh, I think the cheapest one was like silver and then gold, platinum, and then diamond was the most expensive one. And then platinum was the second best one from diamond. Let me tell you guys something. So I was gonna purchase the diamond ticket, right? And I waited too long. So when I went to go purchase the diamond, it was already sold out. So I went ahead and purchased the platinum one because it was the second best one so that's how it went so they sent us out an email saying that registration starts at 10 30 and the class started at 12 or 12 30 i believe and when i got there there was i got there at 9 30 there was already big lines um to get in and it was outside of the theater and <laughs> Every line, you know, was separate according to your ticket that you purchased. So we had the diamond lined, platinum, gold, and silver. And then you also had the VIP and sponsors. So those are like other influencers that are big in the Instagram community. James Charles were the, was there, Gigi Gorgeous, and some other, um, Cassandra MUA, something like that, um, was there. It was a lot of... A lot of influencers were there it was really awesome and um so anyways we were standing out in the cold waiting for mario's class and it was so worth it because at the end i learned a lot but it was so worth it mario standing in your line so we had to stand outside and wait for our turn so what they did was um mario's people that work with him came and started um putting wristbands on the diamond group and you know there was a huge line of the diamond um group so they were putting wristbands on them and then they got to go inside and after that then it was our turn to go inside and we got our wristbands um and it went by section so the diamonds could sit more in the front and then the platinum was behind the diamond we didn't have assigned seats, but you had to sit in your section. So obviously I wanted to get there early so I can sit as close as possible to the front as I could. So I waited in that line super early for my seat and I got a super good seat. I was super excited and I'm running out of breath. <sighs> Before you walked into the theater, after you got your wristband, they handed you a notebook and a pen so it just says the master class on it and then your notebook that you can take notes in and yes i took a lot of notes honey because i'm trying to up my makeup game and it's pretty cool because it has um this bookmark thingy and it also has one inside so i thought that was pretty awesome it's really good quality actually and the pen is nice too so anyways so we got inside and i sat in my seat we waited um they were getting ready everybody was getting seated 
and the class finally started and I'll insert a clip here. I really loved her makeup that day and she began requesting for a lot of her jobs and I started working with her on a regular basis and traveling to LA a lot. Masterclass in LA. Wow. Thank you guys so much for coming. I'm so nervous. Of course, the class went on. Kim was introduced. Then uh, Anastasia was introduced. She taught us the makeup. Uh, her brow routine and how she fills in brows and all that. So that was pretty awesome. I'm going to insert some clips from the class now so you guys can see how everything was nicely done. Beauty icon, Kim Like, so obviously you're not going to see that, but now you guys will be able to see she really does have psoriasis for the first time that's spreading on her face. And I've always wondered if this day would ever come. Um, it's come. <laughs> it, is, it, is a, it is a challenge to cover, which you guys will see later on. Um, so I'm really happy to be here, you guys. I love um, I love what she did. I love. Of course. I love what she did. Um, here in the room. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. You can see my room there. Um, you like okay. what? More feminine when it's softer here in, in the in this area. Well, here. it's not so harsh. If it's too dark in the front and it's not plain dry, it's it's too harsh. Yeah, it kind of and it also I feel like it does this effect where. It and like you know what? The... Yes, what does <laughs> makes the eyebrow makes the eyebrow too close. Makes the eyes too close. Um, but you know, you're gonna still see it. There's nothing, you can only do so much with makeup. Um, you, you know, all the little tricks combined will really make a difference. But I'm gonna take a little bit of that and I'm gonna put it right just exactly like right here. Everything that's, that's being released on a daily basis. So, yeah. you know, there's a lot of them out there. I put a few of them in my kit just to have variety. But I think that different certain people love certain things, and so that really depends also on line, but also with these, if you had sort of um, soft under eye effect, you understand? I'll show you. It'll, it'll... If you purchased the diamond, you had to stay in your seats and lunch time, you know, it was lunch time and then the food was brought to you. Now, if you were uh, platinum or gold and silver, like you'd have to go out um, to the lobby and get your food and wait in line. It was a super huge line. It took a really long time to get your food, but um, it's just really hard to feed that a big amount of people and I actually felt grateful that we actually got fed because um, 
Mario said himself that a lot of people are, were telling him not to do food, but he felt that, you know, since we were there for such a long time, that he felt the need that we needed obviously a break and we needed to eat. After that, we came back, we finished the class, and it was time to take pictures. Now, this is where it gets interesting and the drama comes because these girls want their picture with Mario, Kim, and Anastasia. And now the diamond and the sponsor's ticket included for you to take a picture with Kim, Anastasia, and Mario. Now the platinum one included just a picture with Mario. So um, the instructions were for all of us to stay seated and then we're gonna call us by row. So we all stay seated. So the sponsors and VIP went first and took their picture and then it was time for the diamond to go. Now the diamonds, um, their row started going first. Now there was about maybe, uh, I don't know, maybe 10 rows of, of diamond. Yeah, about 10 rows of diamond uh, ticket holders. So they started going and about the seventh row, some people from the back, like it was also platinum because Everybody on the first level was platinum and diamond. Everybody on the top level was gold and silver. They had already been dismissed to go home and we stayed to take our pictures. So what happened was that once uh, diamond got about to the seventh row, people from the platinum side that were sitting more behind me started coming towards the front and wanting to like get in line and take a picture. And so our section, that we were closer started to get you know bothered by that because we sat outside and we got here early and we we stood outside in the cold for a really long time in order to get our spot you know to get a good spot we didn't come here to get like cut by you guys that came late and sat in the back so it was just not fair that these people were trying to get in and 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 get in there so girls in our section were like hey like you guys need to sit down like it's not your turn and like the people that worked at the theater were also telling them like hey you guys need to go sit back down some girl got in one of the workers face i don't know what she said but the worker was like oh no 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 like you're not gonna yell you're gonna go and sit back down because it is not your turn or else you're not going to take a picture with Mario. Like, she literally straight up told her, like, if you guys don't go sit back in your row and wait your turn, you're not going to be taking a picture with Mario. So, everybody went back to the row. So, Diamond continued their picture. So, now the Diamond area finished. So, their area was empty now. And all of a sudden... Like, we're waiting for us to be called, like, the Platinum. I was probably um, sitting two, I think it was two rows behind Diamond. So, I was pretty close to um, where the Diamond was sitting. So, we were just waiting for us to be called. Kim and Anastasia had left, and it was Mario. Just, um, he was sitting on a chair because he had said that his back uh, starts to hurt with a lot of pictures. So instead of standing and getting a full body picture, he was going to sit. So, I mean, some people I can hear them talking, they were upset, but I'm like, come on, he just gave a whole class standing, bending over with his back, you know, hunched over doing makeup and teaching us. And then he had to take pictures with a lot of girls. So, I mean, I understood that he preferred selfies we're waiting for our turn we see like a group like a huge group of people come from the back again and start arguing with the event planners and with the people at the work that with the people that work there and then all of a sudden we see them sit down um where diamond was and we're like what is going on like what is up with these people and so all of a sudden like once they announced okay platinum you can it's your turn they 
the people that just cut it, like get up and go get in line. And so one of the girls that was sitting in our platinum was like, hey, like that's not fair. And then the worker was like, I don't know what to do anymore. Like she was stressed out. She didn't know what to do. So then we all get up from our section and we're like, oh, hell no, they're not about to cut us. Like everybody get up and let's go. So we're like, oh my God. So girls start jumping chairs. There's coffee being thrown everywhere waterfalls and it was just complete chaos so i'm like oh hell no let me get my purse because i ain't losing my spot i'm going to so i went because it was my turn obviously and so we get in this line and like at this point poor ace hotel theater workers because they just could not control all these girls that were trying to get their picture with Mario. But anyways, I still got my picture with Mario and um he was he was really nice. He's really he's super handsome. He's really good looking. Um his skin is great and oh, primer inside. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I was playing with this and I got distracted. It's a lipstick that I got from BoxyCharm, and then I read it said primer inside, so I'm like, what? And so it's like a two-in-one thing. Okay, anyways, then we got our goodie bags, and we got to go home. So that was pretty much it, and obviously, I mean, it was a little unorganized because of the girls that did not want to follow directions because they had a great system going where everybody just sat down in their seats and waited to be called but people were just getting out of control and i'm going to try to go fast because this is a lot of product this says the master class oh my god this is huge okay so i'm going to place this here and you guys are going to watch me Okay, so first things are vitamins, and this is by Ollie, and this is for sleep, and this is for beauty. Now I got Kiss Lashes, I got Elemis Eye Lip and Makeup Remover, I have Beauty Blender and some of their new foundation samples. And this is like a silk scrunchie that you can sleep in. I got Walford Richards Designs Brush Cleaner. I got a Hula Bronzer. And this is Vichy Hydrates Plumps Fortifies. I think it's like a serum. I got this headband by Glove or Glove. I got a day cream by, by Poor Moy. I think that's how you say it. Got more lashes by Kiss. And this has not been released yet. It's a Tatcha. I think that's how you say it. It's Tatcha the Dewy Skin Cream. Mario mentioned that um, the creator of Tatcha made this thinking about him. So this cream was basically inspired by Mario and we got to try it before it's released. And we also got Laura Mercier highlighter and we got Wonder Beauty eye gel things. We have Laura Mercier Foundation Primer. We have number seven, another number seven primer. Two number seven primers, they're both different. I got more lashes. We have a Lip Plumper by Grande Cosmetics. And these are some coupon codes that I got. Derma Blends Illuminating Banana Powder. We have uh, Tatcha the Silk Canvas. This is a filter finish protective primer. 
also got the 35V, 35V Morphe palette. It's the one with the blue in it. We have Force Vitale or Vitale CC Cream. We have Sally Hansen Illuminator little tanner thing. We also have Karma and Kit Face Mask by Karuna. We have Hourglass Mascara. We have Kopari Lip Gloss. More lashes. I'm gonna just take out all the lashes I got because I got a few. I got lash glue, some more lashes. Um, we got another number seven primer. Hair spun powder. Another coupon code. We got a glow makeup remover. We have Borghese, I think that's how you say it. It's a firming mask. Um, we have a Sephora hyaluronic acid we have body blur body blur hd skin finish by vita Labur laburata i got two i got the skindinavia or skindinavia skindinavia i'm not sure how you say it but i've been wanting to try this finishing spray i'm glad i got it I got the IT Cosmetics, it's like a highlighting palette, and I got Laura Mercier Lip Crayon, or no, this is an eye color. I got Quay Anti-Freeze Hair Sheets, Sephora Lipstick, MAC Lip Liner, Lash Craft Sephora Lashes, I got a... Um, I got a MAC Dazzle Shadow. Look how cute that is. And I got Laura, Laura. I got L'Oreal Paris um, Liquid Lipstick. I got a lot of stuff, guys. I feel so thankful. So I got number seven gloss. I got Radial Lips. I got Milani Satin matte lips. I got charcoal brush cleaner by Sephora. Um, vitamin enriched primer by Bobbi Brown. And I got Kula SPF primer. I got sleek makeup eyeshadow palette. I got, I'm not sure what this is, but it's by Skin Cuticles. I'm not sure how to pronounce that, but this is what I got. I got Sleek Makeup Highlighting Palette, a Cargo Cosmetics Bronzing Powder, or Geezy, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but Restoring Eye Sheet Mask, and Laura Mercier matte lips. Well, I got another cargo uh, blush. Got this. Um, I also got this Milani Gilded Desires eyeshadow palette. Oh, I also got makeup wipes in my. I got makeup wipes in my goodie bag. I just have them somewhere over there because I already used them. Last but not least. I got this cute little goodie bag from Anastasia. Look it. Are you ready to see what's in here? All right, guys, are you ready? Are you ready for this? Okay, so I got a Brow Wiz in dark brown. I also got the Soft Glam Anastasia palette. And Anastasia Sun Dipped Glow Kit. Isn't that awesome, guys? That is all I got in my little goodie bag. I got a lot of cool stuff. And this is the little bracelet they gave me. Um, I did keep it for memories, you know? 
so that is all I got in my goodie bag. I just wanted to say that I'm so thankful and I'm so grateful that I was able to go to his class. His master class is amazing. You learn so much, so much new techniques. His story is touching. I basically teared up and cried during the beginning and his intro of how he became an, a makeup artist and how he started and it was very difficult for him. He seems like he's very humble and he's very grateful for, for where he's at right now. So I would definitely love to go to a master class again. Like it's mind blowing. It's an amazing experience. You're surrounded by amazing people and I really recommend that you attend any master class doesn't have to be Mario's, but any master class, but I highly suggest you attend Mario's class because it is life changing. Like it inspires you to do better. It inspires you to just follow your dreams, chase your dreams, and just to never give up because people will put you down all the time, but you just have to trust your gut feelings and you have to do what you think is best for you. Thanks for watching guys and Yes, I'm wearing the same clothes and the same makeup from my last video because I recorded this the same day. And it's like 1 a.m., but you know what? I'm about to take one of my sleepy things because I am jet lagged. I'm gonna take one of these uh, vitamins because this three hour difference from California is really getting to me because I'm not even tired right now and it's like 2 a.m. I think. Mm. Um, take two gummies. 30 minutes before bed. ASMR guys. Just kidding. Uh, this class really changed me because it inspired me to follow my own dreams and my dreams is to become uh, like the greatest makeup artist that I can be for myself and for my clients and also um, just start out as a businesswoman in this industry of so many businesswomen but you know if you compare yourself to others and how far everybody has gotten and this and that and compare yourself like you're just not gonna get anywhere and you can't give up because there's a lot of companies that freaking make bread okay they make bread and there's a lot of companies that literally make wheat bread white bread brown bread sugar bear bread <laughs> okay now i'm just talking crap but you know there's a lot of companies that make peanut butter there's a lot of companies that make brushes there's a lot of companies that sell lashes there's a lot of companies that do the same thing just a different brand and they are very successful so if you have a dream like just don't give it up like go for it do it and who gives a shit when anybody thinks like this is your idea and if you think it's great then that's all you need really in my previous video you'll be able to see some tips from mario on there that i use mm. by the way i'm wearing fancy girl lashes and this is my lash company that i have started and it would mean a lot if you supported me and followed my page um i'm still working on my website it should be done soon and we should be able to launch it very very soon so stay tuned for that um i'm gonna show you my little box that's what it looks like here and open it again this is the style fancy and on the back it has my name well it has my company name and my website so that shall be up and running soon. That completes my video and hopefully you guys got inspired a little bit and remember to follow your dreams no matter how crazy, how big it can seem. Just do it. You cannot rush success. It does not happen overnight. It takes a lot of hard work and it's only the beginning. Bye guys. See you in my next video.